parenting program with Nibby to improve my Spanish. It's very, very hot here, um, similar to an oven. <laughs> It's very, very different from the Spanish that I learned back home in the States. It's um, very, very fast, and the dialect is a little bit different. Um, some of the consonants are a little bit more relaxed, so if you're uh, a beginner in Spanish and you don't know a lot of words, it might come across as a completely different language that you're not even studying. Um, so I say that if you can learn Spanish here in Santo Domingo, you should be able to speak Spanish anywhere you go. Everywhere you look, there's either going to be a car or a person or someone selling things. So it's very, very, very busy. Um, it's, it can be loud during the daytime. So it's very different um, from, you know, a more quiet city, quiet town. Lots of people always out. There's always someone to, to speak to and someone's always speaking to you in the streets. So. <laughs> If you're a plant-based eater, vegan, or vegetarian, or just a person that likes to eat a lot of plants with your, with your meals, it might be kind of hard for you to find that at public restaurants because most of the restaurants are very heavy on the carbs and starches. So you're gonna find a lot of rice, beans, lots of meat, chicken, pork, and not, not many green vegetables. Um, nowhere that I went was I able to find, you know, like spinach or collards or uh, string beans or sweet peas or anything like that. So it's recommended if you do eat um, that type of cuisine that you go out to the markets, to the supermarkets um, in your area and cook it yourself at home if you can because that's the only way you're probably gonna be able to find it. the flow of the Dominican way of speaking Spanish has really helped me uh, be able to just hear it and pick out certain words that I wasn't able to pick out before. Also, being in the city, since everything's in Spanish, all the markets, all the stores, everything's written in Spanish, it helps you because if you're going throughout the city and you're reading it and everything that you're reading is in Spanish, eventually you start to see some repetitive words and you'll, you know, you might go and look the words up, you're like, okay, what is this? And you're learning words while you're out in the streets. You're hearing people um, say things out, you know, to you. And you hear it multiple times. Eventually, you learn the words. So it's been it's been an amazing stay for me here. Um, I've been able to speak Spanish here in the home. I've actually gotten the opportunity to meet people here, local people here, um, through Nippy. So it's been a lot of fun for me. And I thoroughly enjoyed it. I think I've learned so much, and I'll definitely be back again for another four days.